welcome to my channel. I said welcome, because it's time to get welcomed and it's time to settle in for a gorgeous tutorial on how to style your hair curly. This is really just the season of us embracing our natural curls, embracing our waves, which I'm living for. And there's a few things that are really important to remember about waves. Everybody's curls and waves are very different and they need very different things. And there are so many different ways to achieve a perfect curly look. But today we're gonna focus on diffusing our hair curly and I'm gonna go for as much volume and as much like bodacious curl as I can get. So let's go. Okay, so whether your hair is curly, straight, super tight curls, we do not wanna be over washing our hair. Over washing our hair is the worst thing you can do. The reason that that is, is because it strips out our scalp of all of the naturally occurring oils and it causes the oil glands in our scalp to go into this overproduction mode and it ends up making your scalp super oily and it makes your ends of your hair super dry. Also just another really quick tip for curly hair people. We're washing our scalps, we're not really shampooing our ends. We're really not spending a long time scrubbing and like, you know, the ends of our hair. We really wanna use our fingertips when we wash. We stay up here. And then when we apply conditioner, we really wanna be like using these sorts of stroking motions. So I'm gonna go upstairs and do that. And I will see you all back here in like 10 to 12 minutes in real life. But on this video, it's gonna seem like freshly washed and conditioned out of the shower. And let's get started. I'm gonna start by applying this Fumble and Bumble Curl Primer. Right now, I'm just gonna work all of this wavy product in and I'll tell you, you really wanna hear, it's not even close to wet enough, this hair. You really wanna hear like a squelch and sometimes you just need more water. So I do have a water bottle here. Ooh, and I love this one because it has the most even mist. Ooh. See, now I'm starting to get that squelch that I'm looking for. So now that we've got all that in there, I can see the good scrunch starting to come out. But now what's important is, is we have to figure out where our part is gonna live. I want kind of that casual over to the side thing. So I am just gonna work this in. Now I'm just gonna make sure there's no knots. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start to apply my mousse. But I do wanna make sure that I get my mousse underneath my hair. So what I am gonna do is take from my temples, I'm gonna take this top hair, I'm gonna clip it out of my way, and then I just have this hair, I have a little bit of my hair in the front hanging down, I have a little bit of this hair hanging down, and then I have everything in the back. You can see where the ringlets are starting to form. So I'm gonna kind of enhance where those rings already are with this foam. And I'm gonna do that same kind of squelching motion that I did before, but I'm gonna work it all the way down my hair. So now I'm gonna take another helping of mousse to deal with this top layer that I just brought down. And this is the point where, when I first started doing this, I would kind of panic at this part and be like, oh gosh, there's really like foam in my hair. Um, but that's good. That's exactly what you should be seeing. And you do wanna work that foam up into the crown because that part can tend to get pretty frizzy. So I'm gonna come in and finish up on this side and then we're gonna start diffusing. Okay, so this is starting to look pretty much where I want it. And so now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna start to diffuse my hair. I am gonna be using a Dyson with a diffuser. You could also use a blow dryer that had a nozzle and then use a sock, which you can see here. Um, and now I'm gonna introduce you to my really good friend. Welcome to the show, Tan France. Just kidding. I'm so sorry. It's really just fishnet stockings. Um, these are a great tool for curly hair. I love them. It's gonna help do some of this work for me. And I'm simply just gonna dip my hair forward. I'm just gonna take the fishnets and gather up all this hair. Now I'm gonna turn my diffuser on. Okay, we've been diffusing for about seven minutes. I do wanna take this off and see where I'm at. So that really helped and it made my life a lot easier. Now I'm gonna to start to emphasize my wave without the fishnet. And I'm gonna tilt my hair to the side and start picking up sections. And I'm tilting my head into the diffuser. And you can even rest your head like that to get the back. Sometimes I like to give these diffuser teeth like clear up to my scalp to 
really start to lift and work volume into the into the root. Now, at this point, this hair is like 90% dry. I just want to come into the top of my hair and I'm just gonna start to lift up my root. Now what I'm gonna do, just to finish off the curls, is I'm just gonna cool shot everything. Just make sure that all that last moisture is out so that the frizz doesn't come back for me later. I'm just gonna hit everything for a few last minutes. So this is a very trusty, I actually use this in the shower to comb conditioner through, but also I have one that I keep out of the shower and I do that to kind of just lift up the root of my style so that it's not too flat. This also kind of helps to break up any of those um, kind of more chunky curls. So this is like kind of a chunkier curl and you can kind of just separate it and turn it into a couple curls, kind of thicken it up. I also am a huge fan of texture wave sprays to use. Every company's got a texture spray. I do like this texture wave though. I will just kind of come in here and just lift the hair. I look amazing. I have nothing to apologize for that my hair looks this good. Sometimes I do feel like I want to just put in a little bit of like a moisturizing something at the end. So this is just a little bit of Universal uh, Styling Balm, again, by Shuomura. When I finish my hair this way, it really lasts for days. I can honestly get three, four, five days out of this. Obviously, day three, four, five, I'm gonna do like a half up, half down. But this texture just gives me life. My hair has gotten so much healthier from learning this technique, and I hope you embrace your curls. I feel gorgeous and powerful with my curly wavy hair. I just feel like this looks amazing and I hope you have so much fun with your waves and make sure you like and subscribe and do all the things that you're supposed to do on YouTube. And I love you so much and thanks for coming to my channel. Get out of here. Stop it. No, I didn't mean to kick you. I'm so sorry. You don't have to, you actually can stay if you want to stay and look at these waves a little longer.